Hey everybody, I hope all is well. Welcome to a new series for me on Court Farm. Yes, man, this map has probably been, well, I know it has been very popular. So I don't wanna go through too much detail on it because you guys probably already know it. <laughs> probably already love it. But I just wanted to give my take on it. Um, yeah, and just you know, have a more casual let's play. As you probably know, if you've seen any of my other stuff, a lot of my episodes tend to deal with uh, heavily modified content. And, you know, a let's play where you have to set up a lot of things. But this one is just more me casually playing, enjoying the map. Of course, I'm going to be having mods and I have a lot of modded things added here already. Um, but yeah, I, I just want to play and, you know, hopefully you guys will enjoy my gameplay. Um, I play semi realistically, <laughs> meaning that while I do have some mods, I, I tend to not do too many overboard things. Um, my other my other series is going to focus on kind of the overboard go crazy, you know, have fun type of thing. But this one's just a general play. So this is Court Farms by Oxygen David. Um, also, if you want to learn how to have the rabbits, which are one of the key features and key animals of this map, along with uh, Maze Plus, then please see one of my other videos. I think that one's already dropped already. So just search for, you know, Court Farms and Maze Plus and you should be able to find it or look through uh, some of my videos more recently and they'll show you how to add any custom animal to Maze Plus via that channel with Animal Food Editions as well as, um, you know, modify any animals, uh, what, what you can feed them. Now, it doesn't go into stream detail on that. We focus primarily on rabbits, but that same method can be used anywhere else. Radio. Okay, enough talking. Let's get into some play. Now I have uh, a lot of mods, <laughs> probably about 4,500. I'm going to try to utilize a good bit of them. Now, everybody who plays this uh, starts out with this fantastic house and this fantastic farm. To keep things a little different, that looks like that's a great view. I think what I'm going to do, I'm just actually going to sell this farm and try to find a different one. Yeah. So we're going to sell the farm, all the land at this particular. Let's see what that looks like, actually. Uh, we'll go here. So we have all of this stuff right here. And we go to farmland. So we got 49, 46, 48 and 40. So those are that's a good bit of money. Um, that we'll have. We'll also sell all of the equipment and I don't think I'm going to keep any of that, but we'll pocket all that money and we'll have that in addition to our $100,000, uh, 100,000 farms in dollars. And then we'll start to hunt. Um, I kind of know, I think there's a farm here. I think another one's up here. Um, maybe one over here. I'm not hundred percent sure, but I'm going to ride around the map a little bit. Yeah, and I, I've tested this map a few times, but I haven't really explored it like I want to. I know there's a really cool castle somewhere. I think I just uh, maybe it's 199. Can you buy that? Maybe I'm, I might be the wrong. I might that might be the wrong place, but I know there is a castle. It might be up here somewhere. Yeah, for that price, that probably is what that is. <laughs> I think that might be one of our goals. Maybe we can buy the castle, at least a farmland around it or something, and. I don't know. We'll see what happens, right? We'll just go go along with it. All right. So first things first, I will cut on some things like uh, you know, my speed and whatnot. And I do have the mod. Well, I don't want to do that. I want to sell the tractor. <sighs> this is a nice tractor. <laughs> Almost makes me a little sad. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to sell it. I brought in that made a good bit of money. This is a nice shop. We're going to sell all of this equipment and we're just going to start where we want to start. Is that John Deere? All right, this is the workshop. That's where you can buy chickens. There is a, uh, yeah. 
bunker silo right there. This is where you can do your um, cows. I think there, yeah, there's a front loader. No, I'm sorry, a telehandler here. Ferrison, very nice. 62K for that. We're gonna get rid of the bill for it. Um, I think, I don't think there's any other equipment over here. I know there's some in that shed and I'll do this. I have this installed. So we got the New Holland left and a few implements. I think all that stuff's in that shed. That weight might be over there somewhere. It looks like the weight's over here. Can I open it? Yeah, I can. Whoop. We'll jump over it anyway. There's a weight. We'll get rid of the weight. Okay. Uh, we don't want the weight. Uh, oh, yeah. We have this dump trailer here. We'll get rid of that. And it's located in this other bunker silo. And I think all the other stuff is in here. Yeah. Now, this is a really nice New Holland. Maybe we'll buy it. That's the CH7.70. Ah, yeah. But we're we're gonna do we're gonna get rid of it. It's really good equipment. Don't get me wrong. I just want to kind of <laughs> do do a fresh start. The Amazon has a spreader. Um, no, it's a cedar. Ooh, very nice. The Venta forty thirty, and it's two parts. And I think that's the Power Hero, perhaps part on that. So it's that part. Yeah, they attach. Really cool. How much we get that? About 40, what? About 44K, somewhere around there, close to it anyway. We got the header for the New Holland. Oh, they needed some repair. And the header trailer. So we're up to almost 800K. Uh, nice. Okay, $793,000. Man, that, whew, I wish. Okay, we got a few more things, a few more forks and a weight. Actually, I can sell it from here just to be quicker about it. Sell that and we'll sell that. Okay, that's all said and done. Nice. Okay, um, we're gonna sell the map too. Well, the uh, fields, not the map. <laughs> all right, let's go into here. And then we'll go into farmland. I don't think it's gonna restrict me from selling this stuff. Sell it. Yes, 309 sold. We'll sell it. Yep. And 185 for that one. Let's see how much this big one gets. 309. Okay, that is a good bit. So let's see what our grand total is. 1.76. Well, 1.716 million. That is a good bit of money. Now, uh, one thing I do want to focus on, uh, we did have these, uh, you know, this tent area. You can get some revenue from that. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and buy something. I'm not going to just spawn it here. I'm going to reset my spawn point. We'll get it. We're going to get something different. I, I, I don't tend to play with the same things, but I'm going to play with something I probably only played with a few times. And maybe that is an electric tractor. All right, let's see what we get. That's be the first thing. This will be our. Ooh. I think I kind of want to go with this and this is an electric. Oh, that's kind of cool, too. We'll we'll start. Yeah, we'll start with this. And let's uh, customize it kind of how we want. Electric, I think I like the Nokian wheels there. Let's see, hmm. Can I put a weight? I can put a weight in there. What do I want? Well, I want orange or I kind of like that green in there. Gives it a little pop, ties it to the rest of it. Yeah, let's do that. I tend to like the clear glass, but let's see what options we got. Yeah, just colored glass and that. Beacon lights, I like those. I think there's the other option is kind of like the tree branch <laughs> looking ones, what I call it anyway. Um, I'll stick to the land bower, I think I'm pronouncing that. Yeah, land bower. And that's kind of more integrated into the roof. Uh, warning signs, we don't need no warning signs. I like the seat color. And if I do this, uh, where's that, select camera? Yeah, 
So that's your seat color there. Oh, that green looks good. That, I like the, I like all the things. Uh, let's do cream kind of blends in. Yellow, red, that pops. I think, I'll, yeah, I'll stick with that. All right, we'll go back to the out. If you want to hear the engine, it's electric, so you're not going to hear a lot there. <laughs> uh, it's quiet. Uh, let's see. We'll get the we'll get the Hauer because they kind of have like orange attachments. I think I'm just gonna stick with that, the base color, and the rim color. Um, we'll put GPS on. Good night, man. <laughs> Two hundred fifty-four thousand dollars. Okay, that works. All right. All right, we got our first tractor. Yeah, um, and we are going 34 miles an hour. That's not bad. All right, we're gonna pop over to the shop. Listen to that baby purr. <laughs> you can hear the electric engine starting up for the uh, the integrated hydraulics for the electric, their electric control rather than you know diesel engine control. Um, I'm gonna cut off this little uh, window down there. And let us cruise. Uh, I think we can get out of here. Yeah. Ooh. All right, let me cut off my super speed a little here. I don't think they mind us opening their gate. And I have to remember, yeah, I'm, I'm on the other side of the road here. All right, let's see where we are. So we're, let me back up that. We're here, up in the top corner. But I think I'm going to do, I'm going to drive around this way. Then I'm going to drive down just to see some of the map. And I, I might not do the whole thing where I'm just talking. I'll just probably kind of do like a little montage or something until we find something that we might either find of interest or, or a plot that we want to buy. Yeah. All right. So. Prepare for a montage, I think. <laughs> we'll see what that looks like. I'm just gonna ride around and look. Hmm. I like this. This is very nice. Very nice. All right. Off we go on our adventure. Okay, this isn't really a farm right here. But I do like this area for land development. Like a little bit of a, a little bit of a role play for yeah, it says development land. Hmm. Looks a little swampy. Yeah, well I wouldn't say swampy, but some wet grounds. There is a uh what is this? An area to sell things uh, here, sell point. Let's see where we are. We're over here, what is that? Long metal bells. 
and long metal stores makes sense. There's also this, the sawmill across the street from that and sawmill. There's another store right up the street. And we'll see what that looks like shortly here. Once we get up there, I haven't seen any farms yet, not uh, outside of the one we just sold, but yeah, it's beautiful countryside, man. Just uh, amazing map. So at least we, at least we know where we're gonna sell some things once we start producing things. Oh yeah, I'll cut on some lights, get into this little tunnel of trees. Okay. Oh, there are a lot of like longer fields across on our left up here. There's a lot of long fields. Like I feel like you can do many products and very close fields and harvest them all as you see fit there. Try to get a, uh, without getting too many trees in the face, um, a view of that. But yeah, I like this area. Hmm. Oh, that's beautiful too. I love this like winding river through the map. Like I've seen it in different places. That's great. Okay, well, we'll, we'll continue on. Uh, let me, I'll keep driving until I can find maybe a farm to look at. Cause I'm seeing a lot of farmland. I don't think that's a farm over there. Whoa, whoa, my mouth on the road there. Uh, yeah, I'll keep driving. And, uh, once I see a farm, we'll stop and take a look at it. Okay, I don't know if this is a farm or not. Oh, okay, that sign is gonna be hard to get around, but let's see if we can squeeze around. Okay, not too hard. I think this might be in the area to buy, but a bit of a fixer upper. Yeah, there's a lot of rubble here. Uh, caravan, camper, RV your choice of what you describe it as. I'm kind of curious if you buy this, this is nice buildings. Oh, that is a restoration project if I ever seen one. Oof, at least the engine's still in there. You see the fan right there, okay. Uh, yeah, you gotta get these bins out of here and all that type of stuff. Um, tire, oh yeah, this is a fixer upper. It comes with a kitchen sink. Actually, that's like a, you know, <laughs> Uh, man, that, that's a sink for the washer room, washer and dryer room, barrels. Oh yeah. So I'm going to keep on moseying along. So I think let's look at this map. So we're, where are we? We're here. So we're almost at the Southern part of the map. So I think it's time just to head North. And let's see if there's a map over here somewhere. Oh, not a map, a farm over here. I feel like there should be one. I think, I'm pretty sure that's one right there. So what is that? That is across the street from, oh, the, uh, across the street from the bakery. That's the farm that uh, I think that we just, nope, that's not a farm. So there are two farms coming up. So we're going to look at this one and we're going to look at, I think that is one to look at there. And we are here. All right. So yeah, 
Let's see if we can get through here. Uh, I don't know if we can. All right, we're taking our new tractor off-roading already. Yeah. Yeah, don't, don't tell anybody I'm doing this. <laughs> oh, boy. I hope I don't get anything stuck in my tires. That would not be good. Brand new tractor and back to the dealership. Like, yeah, we need new tires. Okay. All right. Um, let me cut on my hazards because I'm stopping in the road just so I can close this gate back. Can I close it? There we go. All right. And we are off again. So I'll uh, see you guys in a second once we get up to that area. See what that looks like. Again, this map's kind of fresh to me. I'm just riding around. So that's where we were. That's all the land we just sold. I mean, we could buy it back, but nah. Uh, that'd be uh, anticlimactic, right? So yeah, we'll just keep driving up here, see what we see. Okay, I see another sign here. That looks like a sale point, but let's, uh, what does this say? Okay, definitely a sale point, but there is a nice plot of land there. Okay, so flour and, and whatnot can be sold here. Good to know, good to know. I really like that windmill. That is amazing look at it can you see any oh you can go in here i did not know that okay i probably should ask for permission to go in here but uh, i'm not we're just see so you can buy this grain mill for one hundred twenty-one thousand dollars. it's not bad in fact i might actually buy this place um but we have to get established first. Can I go up here? Can I, uh, can I walk? Can I, can I, oh, I can walk. Okay, I'm getting stuck, I'm getting stuck. I gotta go to the top. Oh, this is nice. I like the flooring. Oh, look at that. That is quite the view. I feel like there might be a collectible up here, but I typically don't mess with collectibles, but for this series, I probably will get them if I see them. I know there are a few already at the old farm that we just sold. Um, I might go back and get them. We'll see. We don't own it anymore, but you know, they're collectibles. Uh, there's something over there and that might be a farm right there. So let, let's go look at those two and we'll teleport. So it's right around this corner here. Let's see what we got. It looks like, like a couple more cell points. Valley View. Hmm. Oh, that's a nice Scania truck there. Cell point for something. Ah, and Bill's over here. Okay, cool, cool, cool. These are not the drawers that we're looking for though. We gotta keep on going. Let's see, is this, uh, this is a something. Valley View stores. So that might be just another, oh, that's just another entrance to it, I believe. Yeah, looks like it. So where are we at? We're here. I think you can go around that way. We'll go straight up because that looks like a farm right there, but I'm not 100% sure at this point. <laughs> I don't know what's a farm anymore. That looks like a farm. Yeah, first farm that I've run across here. Home farm. Home. I like that big old gate. That's very nice. So that's where we are on the map. 
So let's 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 uh, let's look around here. All right, let's see what we got. Diesel tank. I think this is the main house, but you can't enter it. Uh, no, you can't. But it looks good. Um, I'm going to guess that's for sheep, perhaps that area there. Mm -hmm. I'll just walk around here. I don't see it. Oh, yeah, you have to buy it first. But I'm assuming this is your sheep pasture, perhaps for cows, something like that. So that's good there. Oh, can't walk around that bush. We'll walk around this bush. Uh, good sheds for storage. Yeah, that looks good. I like that. This may be perhaps a workshop and I can cut on the lights. Um, pretty sure if you buy it, you'll see that. You got a, an extra tractor wheel out here. If you, okay, I'm joking. You can't use that thing. That would be very advantageous because the mill is right there. So if we bought the mill and we bought this farm, it's like, you know, easy pickings, so, so to speak. Ah, so this must be for your, oh, there's a silo. This thing here, um, this must be for your, does it tell me? No, it doesn't. There's a long trough. I'm assuming it might be for cows because I think this is for your milk here. And this is a little pasture for them, I think. Now, I could be wrong on that. But if you buy this place, you'll be able to see what it is. I don't think you can go in this. Good storage for equipment over here. You got a few older bits. Oh, uh, poop slinger. <laughs> yeah, for fertilizing. Uh, well, they already have some sunflowers growing. So this is Isaac Ewing's, uh, I don't know. Nope. Well, that's his field at least. I don't know if he owns his farm per se, but. All right. Now this is, I don't know if this is an area to dump silage or not but it's at least another shed but it looks like oh, there is an area for silage right here so good uh, i don't think this was one nope so yeah at least got one silage bunker so it's good it's, it's laid out tight but i like it still plenty of space like it's pretty compact in a sense but if i feel like it's open another shed there uh, that's where your slurry pit is. Toxic gas. That's that's just funny. And you got another little uh, bunker silo over here. I think that will... No, that is for your manure. Yep, poop. I'm pretty sure. And they have to be probably tied up with this one here. Okay. First stop looks really good. But uh, we're going to keep window shopping a little bit. And uh, we'll hop back in our old McCormick here. And we'll keep looking around. Okay, so it looks like we are here, right? So it looks like this is a farm, perhaps. Uh, that might be a farm. Uh, this is the farm that we owned before. We just sold everything. And I don't think that's a farm, but it could be. Uh... I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to head west and maybe south down this road with all these fields here. I want to look at this area, see what all that's about, and probably head over here and see. I think that is a farm there, too. So we'll try to look at at least a couple more. Kind of interested in a lot of these little features. But uh, yeah, let's continue our journey. So like I said, Westward and southward. Yeah, that sounds right. All right. Oops. Start that back up. So, yeah, we passed that mill, but um, we'll check that out also. So, let's go up here. Well, let me see.
I'm just gonna go down this side road and, and book it around. Summer Lane, it looks like. Okay, is this a one way? I don't think this is a one way. But well, we're gonna find out. Oh, okay. This kind of looks like a farm. I think so. I see a tank right there, a fuel tank, I believe. Yeah, it looks like it. Uh, this might be like a smaller purchasable farm. It's a shed. Yeah, yeah not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, this is a unique kind of drive through shed here. Kind of park stuff around the corner there. Cool. Not quite what I'm looking for, but I like it. Um, feel compact farm over here. Uh, I think we're going south now. So yeah, we'll, we'll drive on down this way. See what they got. Okay, we're coming towards the end of the map. Oh, that big field. Oh, somebody's blowing a horn at me. Let me get out of the road. All right, but that big field. Um, yeah, it's just grassland. So I thought there were gonna be like houses or something over that way, but it looks like it's just, yeah, just a big field, which is cool. I like that. Um, we could turn it into something, maybe a development. Yeah, I think you can buy that area. Now this is interesting. This is a farm, uh, I believe. Yeah, I see a fuel tank here. I like this. I like this. I think I think this is one of the top contenders at the moment. The shed looks really good. Uh, pretty good access to the fields. Like, well, I think they're separate purchasable fields that is hmm but i think we would buy the oh soybeans and it is very well maintained so it's about to be harvestable and hmm, 98 percent yield bonus land area field area is 2.75 hectares So it's like 70,000 per, so probably close to 300,000 for this field. Let's see what it says here. No, a lot less than I thought. It's 192,000. Hmm. I think that's the right field. All right, I got this big old grass field, which uh, you can use for grass, or I think there's a fence. A gate rather somewhere over here oh yeah there's a gate so i think i like this one how big is this this is a big old gate too like double oh yeah that's so cool i hmm i think this is probably our better bet at the moment because what i could do i could just put a shed right by this tree or something and hold like the really big equipment all the rest of the equipment can be stored in those. Pretty nice house over here. Can't enter it, but it's very nice indeed. Oh, we get a BMX bike. I didn't even see that. <laughs> Weasel. Cool. All right. We get a little uh, laundry go around thing. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm you know. <laughs> I should not be just looking at it, but this, this, this is, I think, I think it's the place we're going to get, but, um, let's go explore a little bit more. Let's see where we are. So we're here. There are no direct roads. I don't think that dash line does anything. Maybe that's the edge of the, the map boundary. Perhaps I want to end up there. Uh, Well, you know what they say about the straightest point? Well, the straightest uh, way to get between two two points, that is. Yeah, let's just uh, squeeze in here. We got a tractor that's off-road capable. 
I really gotta figure out what. Let me drive against. Yeah, this is an open plot, so I don't think they care. That is cool. It looks like they're. That's the that's the beyond the map boundary. That I think that's a picture. No wait, stuff is moving over there. What are you guys seeing that? That is a thing. What? That is so cool. I don't know how he did that, but man, that's cool. I like it. Let me uh, let me do this. Uh, let's see, so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. Well, let's try like ten. I don't know. Yeah. Whoa, that was quick. Yeah. Okay. So he has a few models just roaming around in the field. So he has that Klaus uh, Lexian. That's a pretty decent model too. Like it, from far away, it just looks good. And that looks like a, I don't know, don't beat me up if I get Deutsch far or something, a uh, tractor there. Somebody got that wrong, but okay. Yeah, sorry, I'm getting distracted. <laughs> but that is cool, Oxygen David. Yeah, man, I like that. That makes it feel that more real. Okay, I don't think we can go through there, but this field, I'm really considering buying that too, just to do something with. The PDA, or just the mini map rather, uh, whichever one you prefer, will not necessarily update with what's there, but we'll know. It's something we can buy. Now I'm just you know, scoping it out of these fields. I don't think they'll mind me driving through here. Okay, there's something. Hmm, there are more tents and stuff here. Oh, there was a road right here, but it doesn't show on the mini map. Where does that go? That probably goes where we need it to go. It's not driving that ditch, though. We could probably drive out of that, but let's not try it right now. At some point, yeah, we will try it. Now, that looks like a farm, and I believe it is. Yeah, I saw this one on the mini map. Cool. This is a pretty nice farm too. I like. It feels a bit more open than the others. Uh, it's, it looks like something for sheep, pigs over there. I like this field right here. Did he make some of these? I think he did something with the gates. But this looks like a bigger gate than typical. Ah, uh, this is a really good. This is a good one too. I do like this one. Okay, uh, I think it's time just to go ahead and make a decision. So we are here, and I really like this farm. But I like that this one's kind of out by itself. He has this really big field, interesting shape field, good grass field here. Uh, I think that was grass, 144. I think 30 is grass also. Um, 30, though, we can turn into something. 40, 144, we could segment it into different areas we could even buy this one or the even 19 because it's right across the street i think that's like a mini farm or something but 20 i don't know that's pretty good all right we're right here now in this area that has a very long pretty but i won't say rhombozoidal <laughs> but pretty square ish rectangle ish type feel good feels one two and three hmm Let's see what a farmland looks like. Oh, there's a lot more farmland in here than I thought. So that is 83, 107, one, so, yeah. It's only 12,000 for that little bit, 89,000 there. What is this thing? 182. All right, well, I think, I think what I'm gonna do, our first farm is gonna consist of this area. I think at some point we're going to migrate over this way. We're just going to take over the bottom half of this map. <laughs> Probably. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. But we'll start in this corner. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, this area is going to probably be my next likely place to buy. I do like that shit there, though. 
Man, I like this place. I don't, I don't like that stuff there, that rubbish, but we can get rid of it. Probably. I don't know. Have to look into it. All right, we'll drive over here. And this is a, like, if we do buy the areas, a really good track, you know, we could role play having some tractors or bulldozers or something going straight across that way. Let's see. What are my options? That looks like a road. So I'm going to try to take it at least a track. So we'll go up here. Ooh, nice little bridge. Okay. And that stopped looking like a track immediately once I cross that bridge. But this is the way I need to go. Yeah, I'm just definitely right in the middle of somebody's field at the moment. I'm going to drive through right through this bush. <laughs> and yeah, right around this corner over here. I don't think there's anything solid here. Doesn't seem like it. Drove through it. All right. All right, let's pull the trigger, shall we? And we're gonna buy all this corner down here. So we're gonna buy that. Yep. We're gonna buy this. Yep. And where are we at? We're at 1.2 million. What would this be? We'll still have over a million. Uh, what's in 188? Let me see. 188 is probably just grass. It is a big old feel. Oh man, I like that. Let's see. I don't think well, there's not really a way to enter this field. Let me turn on some super speed and see. There, there's not really. Uh well, there's something over here. No, nah, not really. Kind of. I'll buy the smaller field first. And we'll leave this one for expansion or something. We're going to be a little conservative as far as buying stuff, but we're going to buy this field. And I don't know. We got to get some equipment to harvest this. So, yeah, I think we'll just buy this first. This one, we'll buy it, yep. And I think that is it. Okay, well everybody, that I think is gonna conclude the first episode, but we have made some good progress today, I think. Um, we sold a whole farm and we bought a new farm. We have a good field over there that will need to be harvested relatively soon. We have a grass field that I think we can cut. Um, and then we'll start tidying up some stuff around this farm, figuring out placement of things. I'll need to buy some equipment. Uh, so doing some planning on on that front. Um, probably role play getting some of this stuff out of here. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that. Okay. All right, guys, I really appreciate you watching. Thank you so much. Um, hope you have a good day and take care and tune back in for some more fun with Court Farms. All right. Have a good one. You guys take care. Bye.